We hear about this all the time across the valley, women being randomly attacked by the bad guys. But if you, this were you, would you actually know what to do? More to talk about how you can protect yourself is Shannon Langwell as well as Cynthia. Good morning, you guys. You guys are with Nomad Krav Maga. Am I saying that right? Pretty much, Krav Maga. <laughs> Krav Maga, yes. okay. And that actually means something, right? Yeah, in uh, Hebrew, where uh, or in Hebrew, mm -hmm. it means contact combat, so close quarters combat. Really cool. Is what Krav Maga means. Well, let's go ahead and talk about this because you guys obviously talk um, about defending yourself, yeah. but maybe not always women's self-defense. But that's something you guys are focusing on this coming up Saturday. Yes. Yeah, so basically, April is Sexual Assault Awareness mm -hmm. Month. So this coming up Saturday, we have a women's only self-defense seminar in which we're going to teach women how to um, defend themselves with, um, you know, physical techniques, but also with situational awareness, um, mm -hmm. you know, how to go from zero to 100 level of aggressive aggressiveness very quickly, and also um, how to use physical boundaries and yeah. uh, set personal boundaries as well and respond, you know, according to the situation. Yeah, we just had a story about a woman that had her purse almost robbed. Luckily, a veteran was there able to help her, but that's not always the case. So we want to get right into what probably most of the viewers are wondering mm -hmm. is give us a sneak peek at maybe what this seminar um, is going to be teaching what what we can do I know me and Cynthia are going to be kind of um, yeah. your demonstrators here okay so would you like to go ahead and go into yeah. some technique or Let me put this down really uh, quick. real okay. quick so Krav Maga is a system of self-defense okay. that's designed um, to use um, instinctual responses okay. striking vulnerable anatomy of your attacker um, overwhelming them with aggressive uh, aggressive counterattacks mm -hmm. and then getting away as soon as you can. Um, okay. So vulnerable anatomy being groin, okay. knees, eyes, throat, instep, any small joints. Um, we're going to be striking those with as much power as we can okay. um, to disable the attacker. <laughs> okay. I'm just yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't think I can, but. <laughs> um, so um, one quick technique that you could do yeah. very quickly um, is a palm strike. So. Cool. If you wanted to set, you know, like a, a physical boundary first, mm -hmm. you may, you know, get into a slight fighting stance. So you okay. get your dominant leg back. Are you right-handed or left? I'm right-handed. Cool. Right leg back. Okay. Right. Hands up in front of your face, mm -hmm. palms open. All right. And if you were to strike me, you would go with a palm strike, maybe mm -hmm. go to the bridge of my nose. You could even open your hand here with the ridge, the, the ridge of your hand and strike okay. my throat. Um, if it was like a life-threatening situation. But of course you want to make sure you yeah. have your body set, standing. Correct, if, if you, you can. Um, but then mm -hmm. we also, a lot of times, will teach striking from what we call the neutral stance. Okay. So if you just needed to throw it up from mm -hmm. a, a position of not being ready. Mm -hmm. um, but if you were going to do a palm strike, basically you're going to take the palm heel of your hand, and okay. the target would be the nose, okay. most likely. But I'm going to hold it on my chest, okay. and you're just going to strike. So when you okay. strike, I would generally say, rotate left and right, okay. and just hit with power rotation from the floor, okay. all right? Using your body perfect to generate power. I'm scared. All right, so just start light, all right? Okay. So you would okay. hit here. Okay. Boom, nice. nice. Okay, great. So that's very good for your first this. time. Okay. Cynthia might show what it looks like if, yeah. if some training. So she'll she'll hit hard like five, six times. This, 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 this. Nice, and of course, again, this is to my chest with a pad, mm -hmm. but in real life, that would be to the bridge of my nose, the temple, the throat, mm -hmm. wherever she might need to strike, um, whether it's palm strikes, but she may also kick the groin, elbow the face, yeah. um, anything she needs to do, hammer fisting the bridge of the nose. And the you just chin. want to go at it, really. Like, I, I, was, I was not going at it with you because, you know, I didn't want to hurt you. Yeah. But, <laughs> no, but like you did it. You were very, it's like you were being attacked. But I know you guys want to show just one more thing. Okay. Um, you want to do the, the groin strike? Or? Yeah, if we did like a yeah. groin kick um, and then follow up with those palm strikes, maybe an elbow. So more of a combination she might do. Uh -huh. um, so first start with the groin kick, palm strikes, elbow. Nice, good. All right, so um, we do we do other things. That's basically using combatives, yeah. but we're also dealing with um, grabs that they may encounter, like wow. chokes, yeah. um, hair pulls, attacks wow. from the ground, mounted attackers. Um, that's amazing. Lots of different things. That's just a taste of what you guys would learn in next weekend's yes. women's seminar. If we could go ahead and bring the full screen up. It's April 8th, starting at 2.30 p.m. $40, $50 if you register there. All the proceeds go to Safe yes. Nest, which helps women in uh, abusive situations or, or bad situations. So thank you so much for coming thank by, you. you guys. I think it's very helpful to lots of women in our community. And head out there, you guys. But stay with us.